Bill Vinci and Ryan Vinci from the Empire Plate Show. Today we are in St. Johnsville, New York, going to a place called the Parkside Drive-In. Now, this place I am real excited about because unique burgers, unique wraps, sandwiches, and they got ice cream, homemade ice cream. Me and Ryan were checking out the menu before we were coming up, and we saw a lot of good things on here, didn't we? Oh yeah, sure did. So, I could actually already smell it. So we're gonna go inside, uh, meet with the owners, and check out what they got planned for us, and we're gonna save room for ice cream today. Absolutely. Right? All right, guys, call us in. Okay, I'm with Aaron and Sam today. How you guys doing? Good. It's great to be here. This took us a long time to get here, by the way. When we first booked this, it was over a year and a half ago. And with everything that's going on, but now we are back and you guys are open again and good to see the sun out. So we talked a little bit before we went on air and, and I heard almost the whole story about this place, the history behind it. But now I want you to tell us a little bit about the history behind this place and, and what you guys brought to the area. All right, so my parents started this business from property that was given to my father that he inherited from his great-grandfather, one of the first properties that he purchased when he came from Italy, 1912, right around there. Um, so he inherited that property and put a restaurant on it, which was only a 20 by 20, basically a hot dog stand. And then it was addition after addition after they, the blood, sweat, and tears they put into it, um, just grew and grew and grew. Um, and then we were given the opportunity back in 2000, early 2000s, to possibly come back and take over and work towards owning it. And um, we, we made that jump real quick. We both had careers. To, um, down the New York City area, and it took us about two weeks to make that decision to say, yeah, we want to be a part of this, we want to be back in it. Yeah, we want it to be unique. You want to be unique, and, yeah. and that's one of the things we talked about, is some of the uniqueness here with the menu, and you added some of the Italian flavor into it, a little bit of Mexican, so tell us a little bit about the menu and some of the stuff you guys have. Okay, so um, we were a typical seasonal sausage, hamburger, hot dog, and all that. We came back, we wanted to put the quality stamp in everything we serve. We wanted to bring in bold flavors that we were eating out um, in a bigger city area, and we wanted to bring those flavors back because there wasn't a place that had all these different, unique things, and we thought that that was a great direction to go in. Nobody else was doing things that we were had in mind to do. Um, we love Mexican, it's one of our favorite mm -hmm. foods, so we do uh, a lot of Mexican specials. Um, bringing those flavors of Mexico, say, into an ice cream and burger seasonal joint. Right. So we found ways to add those flavors into burgers, into ice cream. They did, his parents did a phenomenal job. Right. They, but it was, you know, your seasonal business. People right. look forward to it, it became a, you know, a thing that everybody would come to and families now we have their you know kids coming right but or we're we've hiring their it. kids or we're hiring yeah to work right. which is a huge part yeah. of the success of Parkside it's not just us it's my parents our family sure our amazing staff that works tirelessly for right. us um, so I, I definitely need to mention all of those because yeah. they're the reason why we're here right you know Absolutely. and we're successful because of them yeah. Well, I got to tell you, I'm excited about being here. We all are excited about being here. We talked about the whole way up. What are we going to try? What are we going to sample? A lot of good stuff here on the menu, so we got a lot of stuff to look forward to. But next, we're going to hit the kitchen. We're going to order a few things off the menu and see how this stuff's put together, and then we get to sample all this goodness. Sounds good. Well, thank you guys so much for having us here today. Looking forward to a fun day with you. Thank, thank you so much for coming awesome. down. Appreciate thank it. You. Okay, so we just got lunch served to us. We got here the uh, roasted garlic and cheddar burger. We got some wachos. Lot got the buffalo chicken with some mac salad. We got the PS signature salad. And what'd you get, right? I got the queso burger. And that's a new special burger for today. Yeah. And then what else we got over here? Well, these are the wachos here, and then this is the uh, signature PS fries the sauce, the bacon, they got the fried onions on it. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah. Food looks out of this world, actually. So, we got a lot of food to eat here, so we're gonna get started. We'll see you guys when we're done. Okay, so our food was absolutely delicious here. I gotta tell you, the burgers were out of this world. I mean, 
not your typical burger joint, ice cream place. Burgers are made fresh, made with love. The waffle fries, the wraps, the salads. Now we gotta save room for the ice cream. Uh, we guess we're getting a flight of ice cream and we got a unique dessert coming. We're not gonna tell you what it is yet, but we'll to show you inside. So, so far, this place is out of this world. Definitely worth the drive to come down and check it out. The people here are fantastic. Um, so we're gonna go back inside and eat some ice cream now, but we wanna thank our sponsors for today's show. Without you guys, we couldn't make this possible. So thank you guys so much. done so we're so Maddie's actually throwing me through the walls right now she said just read it off the thing I'm not gonna step by step so we gotta do vanilla ice cream soft vanilla this one right here just a little bit over the so a small is 5.5 ounces of ice cream and then a baby is 3.5 so you're gonna try to kind of get it in between like the two it does not come we can eyeball I'm ready? never good at math so we're gonna try <laughs> to figure this out all right so let's do this be a little hard to press. All right, good. Good. Yep. Look, Look at that. And we even got a little, we even got a little hat on it. Beautiful. Okay, this is beautiful. Warm caramel. Here's gonna get all over. And make this look pretty. Yes. Right now, I think Manny's a little bit nervous because I might be taking her job. Look at this. Wow, look at that. It's healthy competition. It is. <laughs> okay, we got the caramel on. All right. A little sea salt. So we just do a, how many, how many turns? I like a Maybe couple twists. A couple twists? Yeah. Pretty. Whipped cream. You go around the outside or you try to stay on yep, top? Yep, so just load it up there. Right around, all right. How pretty is that? Okay. No, right up. All oh, you want all the way to the all top? All the way up. We didn't finish. Oh, we're running out. Are you are you shitting me right now? We ran out of. Carry on top. Carry right on top, and then Good. stick your spoon in the side. It's That's lovely. It. That's it. Here it is. Picture perfect. Now we gotta get somebody to eat this monster. Yeah. I think I tried. I got this. That's it. One bite, I'm going to go do it. Alright, really? You just took the whipped cream. You didn't even get inside. You gotta get inside. Get inside the goddamn I forgot there was brown in there. Brownies the whole Sunday. What? How long is this gonna take to make a decision on this? We're all waiting. Presentation, maybe a three. 8.4. 8.4. That's respectable. That's delicious. Does that get, does that get me higher part time? Yeah, you can still get a job. Yeah. I'm here. Yes. I'm here. Okay. I have a black and white cheesecake, our cannoli, and then we have maple walnut. And then over here we have Nutella chip, our new churro ice cream, the dirt road, which is fudge base with fudge swirl and um, crushed up Oreos and mini chocolate chips, and then the cinnamon bun. And, what's this beautiful and that thing is our toasted coconut ice cream sandwich. Homemade this... cookies, vanilla ice cream rolled in toasted coconut. Well, we got some ice cream here to try, so I'm diving right into the one closest to me. Let's see. I'm, I'm dying for this churro ice cream, so I gotta go with that first. I gotta say, very rich. Are you getting that out of the churro? Oh, absolutely. It's very rich. Oh, that's delicious. You're guessing a high fat, fat content, which is always good for ice cream. All right, we're gonna eat our ice cream and we'll see you guys in a few minutes. Okay, I'm with Dominique and Lily. How are you girls doing today? We're doing pretty good. Who's this little one? Join us. Zuki. Zuki. Did Zuki have lunch here today? She did have some chicken. The chicken. You got room for dessert? She is heading out front to get an ice cream. Ice cream, what kind? Of 
vanilla. Vanilla. Gotta get your vanilla ice cream in. What is it about the park side? What, what, what brings your girls here? What do you like about it? The food. The food. And the ice cream. <laughs> and the ice cream. You always got to save room for the ice yeah. cream, they said. The churro ice cream. Oh, God, that that's, was good. Yeah, that that's was what good. I heard. Yeah, that's different. Yeah. Sure, so we got to try that. All right, well, I appreciate you girls being on the show today. Now okay. we'll let you get go get your ice cream. Put it down. Thank you so much. Okay, so we just finished up a great show here today at the Parkside Drive-In in St. Johnsville, New York. Guys, thank you so much for having us here today. Thanks for coming. This was so fun. I gotta tell you, it's not your typical run ice cream burger joint. This is different, this is unique, and everything is made in-house and with love, which makes the difference here. And it was awesome. So thank you guys so much. Thank you. Not only great owners, great staff today, these guys were super, they took care of us. Except Maddie, she put me to work and, and I got a three point something on the pre presentation by my son, which I thought was a lot better than that. But it was great and, and who knows, maybe I'll show up here again to work one day in the summertime. Celebrity night. Celebrity night. Come down and make Sunday. So, but uh, I want to appreciate, thank you guys so much for having us here today. But we'll definitely be back. If you haven't, make sure you like their Facebook page. Give them a like. Come down, drive down, and check it out, man. You'll, it's definitely worth the ride out.